Obviously, if you're trying to force some sort of storyline or rhetoric going go ahead, into go the ahead. final... Do it. I really don't Do want it. To. Force it. I, really, I don't want to force it. Oh, Ooh, look. Liverpool might finish top four. They're what? Not, they're not going to finish top four, Don. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Are you saying there's a chance? No. Well, I suppose there is. I'll give them a 10% chance. Oh, wow. That's all I can give them. Um, it was a scratchy performance today. Uh, listen, they're getting it done, Dan. I yes. think the last three or four games... They've won by the odd goal. They're getting wins. I think it's six on the spin, unbeaten and eight. So, again, I mean, not like Chelsea, but, I mean, they're getting momentum and there's a feel-good factor, I think, for Liverpool fans and Mo Salah gets 30 again for the season. So, he's just been phenomenal. So, I think the Liverpool fans, they've got three very winnable games. So, it could be, you know, it could be a very good end to the season in terms of momentum, feel-good factor, and then see who they can bring in next summer. It's not like... It's felt like Liverpool this season has been doom and gloom for many a week and many a month. And finally, I think for Liverpool fans, the hanging on to a few wins and six on the spin is not a bad return. Anything you'd like to add, Jules? Yeah, I love Trent again in that midfield position. I looked at the start. I think since he started to play more in that kind of role at the beginning of April, he's had his first in the Premier League for chances created, first for touches in the opposition box, first for for passes in the final third. I mean, all those stats where nobody beats him, not even KDB, not other guards, nobody else. And I just think it's remarkable. And yeah, of course, there's still a lot of adjustment to be made, especially when they lose the ball and he's in midfield defensively. But I think if they can get that balance right, I think next season, because now it's a little bit too late, obviously, but next season could be wonderful to see Trent in that position through the whole season in Europe, in the league. But again, there's some adjustments that have to be made defensively. But I thought again today, you know, it's not a great game. It's, it's not a great position, let's be honest, either. But because, I mean, they're a good team, but right now they've got nothing to play for anymore. But I, I thought it was outstanding again. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.